Hey, I was up to me everything track. So I've been gone for the past few days. I was on the trip, uh, went to the mountains, good experience. You know, just got to school uh, like last week. So went ahead and got a trip just to refresh my mind and stuff like that. But now I'm back. I'm back, I'm back, I'm back. So I'm back and uh, what we're gonna do today, I think I'm gonna keep it well, you know, trying to get some endurance stuff. So I'm gonna probably do a 200. 150 to 100 or I might do two 150s and a 100 something like that we're gonna see but y'all stay tuned and uh, we're gonna get the track we can go stretch and we're gonna do these workouts all right peace oh yeah and by the way indoor season has started so I'm gonna finish start doing some more videos on indoor season and stats and just rumors and stuff like that so I'm gonna go back but my videos might be a little bit longer than what they used to be I know back in the summer my videos just be like two minutes long. I might be stretching out my videos a little bit more to four minutes. You know, I'm gonna actually start doing like a little script and like I'm gonna start writing, you know, what I'm finna say now and just uh, try to edit more. I've been using my uh, laptop to edit my vlogging, so I'm finna actually start doing better vlog. I'm just like, it's gonna start looking like somebody that I watch. Uh, I'm gonna keep it at that. But somebody I watch, I'm gonna try to be more professional with my videos. So just stay tuned on that, all right? So we're gonna try to be more professional uh, this season than we did last season. You know, this season, this past season was my first season. I made this channel in what? June, basically. I made this channel in June. Uh, so I got time now. I got time. So we're gonna see how this goes. We're just gonna go off from there. Hey, y'all, what's up? It's me, Everything Track again. Uh, back to you with voiceover. And instead of 150s, like I said earlier in the video, I ended up doing 120s. So we're going to see how I do on here. And I have been feeling like I've been doing a little better when it comes to running. Uh, I still need to work on my endurance, but I feel like my endurance is getting a little better. I'm still a no, novice sprinter, as you can tell. You know, never really sprinted. I sprinted last year. It was my first time ever even doing a 100 at a track event. Uh, my best time was 12.07 weighing at 202 um i have a lot of backside mechanics right now so i'm gonna get some wickets to work on that but right now i just i just really want to get ready overall uh, as a track runner for this season and uh i plan on doing indoor but to do indoor you have to be a real good block starter right and to be a good block starter uh this is where this app comes in right and the app I'm talking about, and you'll see me use it early, uh, later in the video, it's called Start Gun. And it's free on iOS devices. I'm pretty sure it's going to be free if you have a Android device as well. So it might be free on the Google Play Store, apps, uh, Android Store, whatever it's called. I'm not sure what it's called, but I'm pretty sure it's free on there. And basically, it helps you with your reaction, right? So... It goes from 5 seconds to 10, 15, 20, 25, all the way to 60 seconds. And the guy on there is like, on your mark, you know, he's get ready, set. And then you don't know what he's going to say, go. It could be a one-second delay, five-second delay. You never know. That's the whole point of reaction, uh, of the start gun app, to focus on reaction, right? And I'm glad I got this app because, especially right now, since uh, school is over with, if you guys go to college, I'm pretty sure your coach told you to work on, uh, work on your own, right? So... Or even high school, but I doubt if you're in high school, you're working on the track. You're in during track season stuff right now, unless you go to like IMG Academy. <laughs> but if you are, um, here we go, another one twenty. And for the guys that don't know, I I'm still heavy. I weigh I weighed myself this morning. I weigh two oh nine, so I weigh two hundred and nine pounds. I'm at six feet. Um, you can tell I, I do have big legs. Like I do work out. I only work out legs, though, uh, believe it or not. A lot of people think I work up upper body as well, but I don't. I actually just work out legs, and the upper body just comes with it. <laughs> but I need to lose. Uh, I'm trying to lose weight. A lot of it is going away. A lot of fat is going away. But since I keep working out muscle-wise with legs, the muscles aren't going away. So it's like the weight's not going away. You know, I'm trying to get down to 200 to 190. I'm trying to before the season starts. We're going to see. Hopefully, I get there. Um, but my back does naturally arch, and the guy said something about backside mechanics. So he said you should get wickets. So I'm gonna go buy some wickets. I have cones, but I think I'm gonna get wickets anyways. Uh, be my own little Christmas gift to me to help me out uh, run better. 
But here's where that uh, start gun app comes into handy, comes in hand, right? It helps you with reaction. Um, you can't tell, but when it when the guy popped the gun, I was late, right? I was probably like a good one eight. I mean, point eight to a second off reaction. So when he said "bah," like when the gun on the app goes "bow," I probably took off like half a second to a second later. And that's the whole point of the app to have a good reaction so that way you can decrease unnecessary time that you had just wasted on yourself right so i'm gonna start using it and like pow and like i think he said bow and then i went like a second later so i think i'm doing like 20 meters right now uh we don't have, like i can't the white marks aren't seen from where that 100 meter is i'm at the 100 meter line right now into where my cone is you can't see any white marks that uh show 10 meters uh I'm at the USM track and there's white marks, so uh, it helps you know which 10, like how far each 10 meters is, but you don't have them at this point. But anyways, I believe I did 20 seconds, and this is the last one right here. Uh, I'm still not pushing out all the way with my leg, so I need to work on that. There's a lot of things, there's a lot of things I need to work on, so we're going to keep working on that. We're going to keep working on reaction time. Uh, we're going to keep working on just being a better track runner, get that faster as a track runner, and hopefully get in a PB. You know, this is my first uh, season that I ran. Uh, this past 2022 season it was my first time ever running a 100, and I went down. I went from 12:33 to 12:07, right? So hopefully, and that's a uh, computer time, not not hand time. That's computer time. 12:33 to 12:07. So. Hopefully electronic time. That's what I meant electronic time. So hopefully this season I'm in the 11s and then hopefully next season I'm in the 10s. That's the whole that's the goal to get better and better. Do I expect to be Matthew Bowling? Well Probably probably not But do you expect to be me probably probably not so <laughs> we're, we're gonna see but anyways uh, just just working on sp sprint endurance and just block starting again just kind of trying to get more proficient in what I do so with that being said if you like the channel uh, make sure you like comment subscribe I do videos on famous track runners and what they're doing in their day in life like Shakar Richardson and Abby Steiner Shelly and Fraser Price Marcel Jacobs Fred Curley but I'm doing more uh, workout videos uh, I know there's a lot of people that like to show themselves you know like vlog like vlog a d1 life of a track and field athlete you know but like they don't do anything in their videos they just show themselves in class like i'm pretty sure everybody is watching a youtube that youtube video has been to college or is in high school or is out of school and been to class before like that's to me it feels like a waste of time to be like day of a college track runner uh you know and you want you try to gain something from their videos <laughs> But they're not posting themselves track running, you know, like running track really, you know. They're doing like snippets, but they're not showing you anything. So, right? So, there's people like me and Athlete X. Uh, I want to show you what I actually do. I want you to focus on the actual running part, not the, uh, I'm going to Chick-fil-A and getting the eight-piece, you know, number three eight-piece with Polynesian sauce part of uh, the day that's going on. <laughs> you know, I'm trying to show you the track part that's going on. So uh, hopefully you subscribe to me for that. Um, we're going to road to 5K. Hopefully we can get to 5K, especially when indoor season starts. I believe my videos will start jumping more uh, since it'll be track season now. So uh, with that being said, I'm going to see y'all later. Uh, make sure I have a nice day. All right, peace.